Hey guys, Ray the Video Guy here, and as promised, I'm doing a quick little review of Gorilla Evolution, which is a great little software that allows you to quickly and easily put laser-targeted content from various sources onto your uh, WordPress page, onto your Facebook pages, your Tumblr, or your Blogger blogs. Uh, and I want to show you exactly how that works and why this is a very, very cool piece of software. Uh, one of the biggest problems that I see all the time is the fact that Facebook pages are created by whomever, a plumber or somebody who's just interested in dog training or whatever. And after about two days, they stop posting anything and it becomes this dead zone. And then a month later, they come back and they post something like, uh, hey, buy my new book. And of course, they've lost any fans they have because they haven't done anything in, in a month. So what this does is it allows you to find content that makes sense for your audience and post it automatically to your Facebook page or to those other sites. Now, for me personally, it, this is mostly going to be about Facebook because that's what I really, really wanted to work with on this. Because if anybody did any of the recent Facebook trainings like Facebook ads cracked, etc., you were taught to create a Facebook page and then be able to sell t-shirts on there or what have you. And the problem is that you need content for those to keep people engaged because otherwise when you finally post your t-shirt or whatever, nobody's going to be there to pay attention to it. So what you want to do is you want to be able to do what they do here which is to take stuff like flash games, uh, information from the New York Times, RSS feeds from other sites, articles, iTunes, YouTube, Amazon, as well as a, a few other places, and post things to your fan page and to those other sites for you. So for instance, if you have a site like I do, which is an MMA fans site, what this will allow you to do is post a bunch of stuff to this that are related to mixed martial arts. So if we head over to my WordPress site here, I've got Gorilla Evolution already installed, and you can see these are the uh, preferences here for various things, both your preferences, preferences for your, your uh, different sites, so the Blogger, the Tumblr, the Facebook, and then all the preferences here for various uh, sources. So article sources, Flickr, Yahoo, YouTube, recipes, iTunes, GIFs, New York Times, games, Instagram, etc. Amazon as well. And what this allows you to do is to put in a keyword and pull stuff from these various sources. So for instance, Amazon. And the great thing is if we click on Amazon here, not only will it pull stuff that's related to this, so if I use Amazon as a source and let's say the UFC, Ultimate Fighting Championship, as my keyword, well, what this will do is when I plug in my affiliate ID information here, which I haven't done yet, it will pull stuff from Amazon that makes sense for that audience. So stuff related to UFC, stuff related to mixed martial arts. And of course, because it's uh, it, it's got my affiliate ID in here, anything people buy from the page will automatically be credited to me. Okay, so here is my campaign that I created already. You can see my keywords are MMA, UFC, and Bellator MMA. Now, one thing I have noticed right away that you want to pay attention to is be careful with your keywords. Uh, in this case here, MMA is seems like it would be a great keyword, but the problem is there are so many things that have that three-letter combination in it that I have to pay attention to what it pulls to make sure that it's actually relevant. So we may actually get rid of that keyword and just stick with UFC and Bellator, uh, maybe add a few other things in here that are more specific and won't pull information that doesn't make sense. Uh, you can see the different types. We've got articles, we've got GIFs, we've got New York Times and four more others here. And I'm going to hit edit here so you can actually see this how this campaign works. Okay, so you can see for this particular one here, this campaign, MMA fans. It's attached to MMA fans here. I've got articles, which I'm actually going to get rid of because it doesn't make sense for Facebook content to post articles most times. The animated GIFs are great for this. Uh, New York Times articles, we may get a few here and there. Probably not going to get a lot from that. YouTube videos are going to be big for this particular audience. Amazon products will be great. iTunes, there's a lot of podcasts that this can pull. Uh, and then RSS, if we set up a site for that, I'm, I've got the RSS attached here. I don't have a feed put in there for this. You can come down here. This is where you can edit your keywords. 
And then these are the campaign settings down here, which you don't really want to touch. That's kind of automatically set up. And now if I want to, I can preview. And you can see that we've got different things. Here's, an, here's a, uh, a, a GIF that makes sense. That's uh, one of the UFC fighters, Dan Hardy. Uh, we've got, look at this, we've got a new YouTube video that wasn't there before. Looks like uh, Rampage and Chuck there. Uh, now, okay, so uh, here we go. We've got uh, an iTunes song. Now, this is a song by Pitbull. I don't even know who that is. Isn't that sad? Um, and you can see that's where the MMA thing is, is kind of hurting us because it's pulling in things that don't quite make sense. So we're actually going to delete that. Okay. You can see now we've got UFC GIF, UFC YouTube video, UFC from uh, iTunes, which this is really cool. This is a, uh, I believe it's a video podcast that, oh, actually, this is a paid for uh, fight night you can actually buy, which I didn't even know you could buy that off of the store. Uh, and that's the other thing, too. If, you, if anything it gets posted from iTunes, you can put in your iTunes affiliate code as well. So if somebody sees this on the site, buys it, we'll get credit for that as well. Then we got Bellator. You can see animated GIF there, a video. So just all this great content that's just pulled up automatically. And literally, this, all of this stuff that's pulled up here was different five minutes ago when I did this. So it keeps pulling up new stuff, which is great. So we're going to hit update that. We're going to close this. And now we're going to go back to our campaign. And I've got it set to post every hour, as you can see here. But it hasn't been an hour yet, so it hasn't posted anything onto this particular site yet. But we can hit post now, and we can actually do number of posts. And I'm going to do three. And I'm going to hit post now. And there we go. Posts created three. So now if we go back to our MMA fans page here and we reload this and you can see that our stuff has already started to be posted here. So it's just a very easy way to get great content onto your uh, fan pages and to your WordPress blogs and your Tumblr blogs. Another thing that's worth mentioning is the training inside of Guerrilla Evolution. When you Once you're inside Guerrilla Evolution, they've got all sorts of training in here. So it walks you through all the different processes of getting these things set up because it is a little bit of work. You do have to set up, uh, you know, different APIs and things like that. So this walks you through everything. And it's also got a Facebook group for you to join so that you can uh, talk with others that are doing it and you can get support here. So overall, Guerrilla Evolution, a fantastic product. Like I said, if you've got fan pages and you spend too much time trying to update them or you just don't update them at all, this is the program you need to get right away. It just got uh, awarded product of the day because it is such an excellent product. So check it out. And of course, in the in below this uh, video, you can check out the bonuses that we have. And uh, we'll send those to you as soon as you purchase.